Last season was one of frustration here at Greater Latrobe as the Wildcats went just 3-7, and seven, including four losses by nine points or fewer. They have a new head coach in Ron Prady, however, who brings a championship pedigree by way of Penn Trafford. As a result, the Wildcats will look to turn those narrow losses into victories in 2022. Prady has already helped bring a championship to Latrobe as the Wildcats won the Westmoreland 7-on-7 seven -seven tournament over the summer. That shows that the skill positions are not lacking, even with a sophomore QB. John Wetzel has looked advanced beyond his years, while Colin Stevens and Jayton Williams are among the talented pass catchers. Pittsburgh Central Catholic transfer Robert Fulton, a running back and linebacker, will also make an immediate impact. Still, the Wildcats realize they must find the recipe to finish games better in 2022. Uh, I think that's still what we're trying to figure out, but I think being out here and finishing strong is the biggest part. So we come into practice, of course, you're going to have energy at the beginning, but making sure the energy is still high at the end, I think that's what we're working on. And I think we've done a really good job this year so far doing that, closing out practice as strong as we start. In the trenches, players like Wyatt Held and Dan Calabrese will need to fill some voids left by graduation, while Wetzel, Alex Tatch, Connor Lakin and Borio will be vital in the Wildcats' new odd front defense. While Borio carries himself like a leader already, he expects to get plenty of help in that aspect. I think everybody, everybody's going to lead this year. It's not going to be one person, multiple people. Everybody's going to have to step up and lead, and we might have captains or leaders, but everybody on that field is willing to step up when needed, for sure. Dropping down to 4A, Greater Latrobe must contend with perennial powers Thomas Jefferson and McKeesport, while teams like Laurel Highlands, Ringgold, and Trinity are relative unknowns. Fortunately, there's nothing unknown between the players and Prady, who has been a teacher at the Greater Latrobe School District for years. I, I knew him since middle school, so I was really close with him. Um, his qualities, he's a great man. He's a great coach. I love him. I love all the coaches. I love everything about this team. It's, it's great. I love it. The Wildcats will begin their season with three non-conference matchups against Westmoreland County opponents, Derry Area, Franklin Regional, and Hempfield. They will then begin the conference with a tough matchup against Thomas Jefferson.